Hi, I'm Dr. Jan McBaron. Have I got a sweet message for you. I'm here to talk about all the different sweeteners that are available and why it's the artificial sweeteners that makes you so fat. Now we've all heard about the rainbow foods. You know, you eat red tomatoes, orange carrots, blueberries, green kiwi. Those fruits and vegetables are the rainbow foods that make us healthy. But what are the rainbow foods that are sweeteners that make us really unhealthy? The rainbow foods and sweeteners include sweet and low, NutraSweet and Splenda. The pink, the blue, and the yellow pack. Let's start with Sweet and Low. Sweet and Low is 100% a chemical. If you read the package very closely, it'll tell you that it has been associated with causing cancer. So you want to stay away from Sweet and Low. NutraSweet, on the other hand, NutraSweet was discovered by a chemist who was trying to develop an artificial plastic. In the process of discovering the liquid plastic, he tasted it. It was sweet. He said, that's the end of plastic. Let me market this and sell it as a sweetener. The problems with NutraSweet are numbness and tingling, increased seizure activity, and neuropathy. Not a good thing. And the yellow pack, Splenda, you think it's so good for you? Well, let me have you think again. The yellow pack starts out as sugar, so yes, it does start out with something from nature, but then they extract hydrogen and replace it with chlorine. That's right, chlorine, just like Clorox bleach. And I personally don't want to eat anything that has to do with Clorox that I wash my clothes in. But on the other hand, what they've been shown is that in diabetics, Splenda raises your hemoglobin A1C, which is a direct measure of how much damage is happening to the inside of your arteries every time you use it. So what are you supposed to do with these artificial sweeteners? They're supposed to be calorieless so that they'll help you lose weight. Do you lose weight on them? No. In fact, you actually gain weight on them. Why do you gain weight on them? Because they fool your brain. They have no calories, but they also have absolutely no nutrition whatsoever. So when you eat them, your body starts to crave more and more nutrition. So when you consume Sweet and Low, NutraSweet, or Splenda, you are actually driving your appetite up because you will not allow your body to become full. So your brain gets confused and you will always overeat. Now one of the most popular sweeteners that originally starts from nature is high fructose corn syrup. That's right, it comes from corn. But they take the corn and they distill it down and distill it down and distill it until it becomes this very thick, highly concentrated sugar that is no longer natural to your body. Your liver can't process it, it drives your insulin level up, the organs of your body, it's a fake sugar to them, and it's extremely bad for us. And where do you find it? Virtually in everything that's sweet. Soda, ketchup, salad dressings, candy bars, cakes, cookies, pies. You wouldn't believe it. If you start reading your labels, it will surprise you all the places where high fructose corn syrup is located. You need to try to stay away from it if at all possible. So come on, we all like something sweet. How are you supposed to get sweetness in your diet that's natural? Well, there's two ways to do that. First of all, we know that sugar, white domino sugar cane, is sweet, right? It comes from cane sugar. The problem with that, however, is that it's just empty calories. That has all the calories and no nutrition. So we need something better than that. What's better than that? First and foremost, there's a plant called stevia. Stevia is a natural sweetener. It's been sold in health food stores for years. Stevia not only has no calories in it, but it gives you therapeutic benefits such as improving your immune system, decreasing tooth decay, help stabilizing blood sugar. So it's very sweet and it in fact gives you health benefits along with sweetness. Remember, get your stevia in your local health food store. Coca-Cola recently has developed a patent on stevia and they're selling it in the supermarkets under a trade name. Don't trust it. What they've done is they've somehow, somehow altered the original stevia plant to get a proprietary blend, which they won't tell you what it is, and I suspect is going to be problematic. But you know what one of the best sweeteners in the world is, and it's 100% natural. Mother Nature and the bees give it to us. That's right, it's honey. Not only is honey sweet for you, but honey has tremendous amounts of protein, vitamins, minerals, natural things that your body needs, along with that sweet taste. So yes, it's true that honey has calories, but it also has nutrition, and so by eating honey, your brain will sense your fall, and you won't gain weight necessarily because of it like you do with the artificial sweeteners. 
And what I'd like to do for you is show you my honey right now. Come here, sweetheart. Hi, honey. This, folks, is the sweetest honey in the world. Thanks for watching.